Josh Sider has accused 90 Day Fiancé star Natalie Mordetseva of making him lie to the network to be on TV. The 35-year-old Chicago resident is known for his involvement with some of the most notorious TLC cast members in the last couple of months. Initially, Josh made headlines for dating 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days alum Yolanda Leak. Despite a 20-year age gap, the couple survived a few months before Josh called Yolanda a scam artist and broke up with her. Soon after, people saw The Bachelorette star hanging out with Kareem Martins. The two built a decent connection amid the single mom's custody battle for her kids, but they split up due to a lack of trust. Josh's latest Instagram post leaked screenshots of alleged private messages with 90 Day Fiancé's Natalie Mordetseva, where the two discussed featuring on a show. In the chat, Josh answered the Ukrainian native's question about how she can get cast to Bachelor show, by stating, be with me we can be on together. Natalie replied, no I am in a relationship, and isn't looking for a boyfriend. Josh claims that he's negotiating with ABC Network and that Natalie is a perfect candidate to co-star with him on a show that focuses on his life as a bachelor looking for love with the right woman. Natalie said she is filming 90 Day, The Single Life, but she can consider appearing on his show for an episode, and Bachelorette alum Josh could act like he didn't like her. 90 Day Fiancé fans react to Natalie Mordetseva's texts Natalie claimed she is one of the top stars, and could be great for the network, but doesn't agree to kissing or holding hands with Josh for TV. While Josh poked Natalie about her marriage status for legal reasons, she didn't reveal it, stating it wasn't important. Josh disabled comments on his post, but a 90 Day Fiancé fan account, 90 Day Daily, shared the screenshots online, which has revealed fans' reactions. An Instagram user wrote, I mean does her wanting to be actress surprise you people? Another user chimed in, it could sound like her but she's being so forward, bold and forceful that idk. Someone else wrote, hopefully they fire her now. Throughout the conversation, Natalie sounded desperate to be on another network to expand her brand after moving to Los Angeles. As a result, she even preferred faking it for an episode if the network wanted her. Josh's alleged DMs paint her negatively and could cost her big, regarding her relationship with TLC. The exposed texts will also make her next appearance on The Single Life far less interesting and compelling to watch. The leaks seemingly prove that Natalie is quite calculated and not as innocent as she portrays herself in front of cameras. However, Natalie doesn't explicitly mention conning the networks in Josh's texts. She just shared her desire to talk to the ABC network about a single episode deal, where they can feature her as a cameo to bring more eyes to the show. Natalie's goal is likely to keep working as a reality TV star and expand her career while she is in LA. Therefore, it is hard to blame her for wanting to dip her toes into other ventures. Overall, the screenshots make Natalie sound bad, but make Josh seem even worse for leaking private texts after the 90 Day Fiancé alum denied being intimate with him. Source, Josh Sider 90 Day Daily, Instagram.